Today's the day, bro. I've roped Arno into it. He didn't know it, but I've roped him into it, fed him at a bry, and now I'm gonna make him work on the Cummins with me. Take off the injector lines, take off the return lines, gonna take off the valve covers, gonna remove the P pump, and then we're gonna remove the camshaft as well today. So we're gonna show you how to remove the lifters, gonna show you how to remove the rocker arms, gonna show you how to tie up the lifters so that they don't fall into the engine. Well, let's see if we actually pull it off before we show you how we do it, but we're gonna try. And then yes, I know here. He looks pumped for the job. <laughs> but yes, we're ready. We're going to take off this timing cover as well, because as you can see, that thing smashed. I think the killer dial pin came out. So here we go. Dun, 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 dun. dun, dun. <laughs> take off this oil we need to take off this return line and then inside there is where the real fun starts because there's a fuel there's a, a fuel line in there we have to undo then we need to undo the main bracket of it down here it's got a support bracket and then we're going to take off the nut on the front and pull off the cam gear well cam gear p-pump gear and then that's the pump out the way put it on the shelf there Just so yeah, you know, nice. that came off easy because I did actually take it off earlier. There, as you can see on the side of the P pump, between the block and that, you have to get this one out here. It's a 15. So you have to undo this line here before you start messing with it. Because if you undo everything and that one's not undone, it won't let it go.
you can see, the first lifter is off. I'm gonna take all the rest of them off now. Make sure to keep them organized. You wanna put the same ones back where they were in the same places, because they've got wear patterns that you want to adhere to. Don't be mixing them up. All right, here we have our homemade puller to pull off the P-pump gear. Two bolts, let's go. Turn it on her, let's see what happens. Heat is on. Will the weld hold? Will the bolt? All right, I'm here with Anna. Again. Again. Round number. I don't know if we stopped counting, but we managed to get a bearing puller going. We used that to pull off the P pump pulley. It's quite a process. It feels like it's going to snap and then eventually it just pops off quite easily. But yes, keep an eye. Here we go. We're about to take the P pump and everything off and get this timing cover off and pull the cam out. So if you've ever wondered how to pull the camshaft out of a Cummins 6BT, here's how you do it the wrong way. As you can see, it's quite an adventure getting to that bolt down there. It's got quite a contraption going all the way down there. Lots of swearing. But we're making progress. We're making progress. So me, I'm busy cutting a dowel rod. You take a dowel rod, you file the end down, you cut a little slit inside there to give yourself a, almost like a pressure spring type thing. And then you hit this into your lifters, pull them up. I'll show you once we open the side cover. There we go, the P pump is off. Now we can actually see what is the real reason why we took this damn thing apart it was for that side cover. There we go. And there's the real reason there. Eh? That gasket there is perished in that corner there. It's rock hard. Eh? Check it out. Let's get this thing here.
So as you can check, we've got all the lifters, cable tied up, started pulling the cam. Not as easy as advertised, that's for sure. So Arno's gonna try finesse it because he's got these soft, sexy hands. And we're gonna see if we can lure this girl out of here. How's that, man? Yes, check it that <laughs> bro, that? like a fucking boss, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Should have known, bro, when it comes to shafts, it's your department. Okay, there we go. The camshaft is out. Let me take that off on his hand so that he can stand up. And then... Camshaft P-pump off. Cummins Rebuild Experts 2.0. Right, final update on the Cummins, because the next video will be basically the cleaning and painting video and then the reassembly. So there you can check. We've got the camshaft out, we've got the timing case off. That thing was pretty broken. I can't believe that these guys actually put it back in like that. Check that. So yeah, that's out now. Anna's busy cleaning up the gasket seals there. I'm gonna take the sump off still. Got the cam out, P-pump off, lifters all in place. Got the dowel rod going. And then next video you'll see, we'll, we'll paint her and then start assembling her. And then there'll be the fire up video. But that basically wraps up the disassembly video. And then we'll do a reassembly video. As you can check, there's the P-pump. Camshaft. All the insides. We had to also even take the engine bracket off to get the timing cover off. That's what Arno looks like while he moves. 